When a Charlotte man dropped his phone in a lake over the summer, he thought it was a goner. But all of these months later, he has his phone back. Savannah Levins explains how it's all thanks to a social media star. Alex Presley shot into TikTok fame with his family's quarantine Olympics. But he posted a different kind of video last week. So I'm scuba diving Lake Norman, North Carolina, about two months ago, mostly finding glasses until I found this. It's a brand new iPhone 11 sitting in the mud. The phone was locked, but the background looked like a photo of him with his two daughters. So TikTok, do your thing, blow up this video. Let's find who owns it. And in true viral video fashion, they did. I went to bed. I woke up less than 10 hours. I already figured out who it was. He said their nephew found it within two hours. Hey, Uncle Dan. Turns out Dan Musella lives right up the road. Good, nice to meet hey, you. Hey, you too. Can we do a quick check here? <laughs> and yeah, it checked out. Oh Yo, man, I can't believe it. All these months later, there's my phone. Dan says he lost the phone to the lake in July. You know, a day on the lake with friends on a boat where I jumped in the water and didn't even realize I had the phone in my pocket. Alex, I mean, you put it in the rice. Were you expecting it to turn on like that? No, not at all. I mean, it was, I found it like 25 feet and then it was under dirt. Um, and it looked like it had been, the case was all molded up. But alas, technology once again proves its strength in more ways than one. TikTok did their thing. We could all get some good karma going into 2021. It was a rough year, so like, you know, let's start off the year on a good foot. Just the fact of him doing that and then following through on it and, you know, just having, you know, wanting to give something back to somebody, you know, that was awesome. And, you know, now my wife gets a new phone, so that's cool. <laughs> Dan's also excited to get back the family photos he thought he'd lost once he figures out how to unlock it. Yeah, well, I can't get past this screen because I, I don't remember Here's the passcode. A... Now, you don't remember the passcode? <laughs> no, I've had to change it like two and three times since then on my new phone. So um, I'm probably just going to take it to the AT&T store, have them help me restore it. A near perfect end to a wild story that turned Uncle Dan into a TikTok fan.